this is 38th program and in this program we are going to check the next pattern expected output is something like this like the previous program we also have spaces in this section so let me first explain logic for this program we will require a loop for repeating these rows so suppose user has entered five so there would be five rows then on the first row total number of star is one and number of spaces are four and then on the next line number of spaces are three then two one and zero and number of stars are incrementing two three four and five so in order to print these spaces we need our loop from one till n minus i that is when my n is five and i is one loop will be from 1 to 4 and in the next iteration of i loop will be from 1 to 3 and so on and for printing this stars in incrementing order we will require another loop for j that will be from 1 to the value of i because on each row number of stars are equal to the row number so let me explain you the program now so this loop is for your all rows so user is entering n over here then this loop is for those n iterations starting from 1 till n and then this for loop is for printing spaces notice that i'm using one new variable k starting from 1 till n minus i so in the first iteration n will be 5 minus i which is 1 so 1 to 4 so 1 to the 4 spaces will be printed in the first iteration of i and then the for loop will be terminated and in the next for loop j is starting from 1 till j less than or equal to 1 which is 1 less than or equal to 1 so this loop will execute for one time hence a star will be printed over here then because of this printf statement cursor will come on to the next line and then i will be incremented so i will be incremented to 2 then this for loop will be executed for three times so three spaces will be printed and then next for loop will execute for two times then two stars will be printed similarly in the next iteration of i two spaces will be printed then three stars will be printed then in the next iteration one space will be printed and four stars will be printed and in the final iteration where i becomes five this for loop will not be executed because the condition will be five minus five which will be zero as we are initializing k to one k cannot be greater than zero hence this for loop will not be executed hence on the next line space will not be printed however the next for loop is going to get executed for five times because i is become five now and because we are initializing j to 1 so condition is 1 less or equal to 5 so this for loop will be executed for 5 times so 5 stars will be printed over here then the cursor will move on to the next line and then the main for loop will be terminated